have been utterly obsessed with this nut pod almond creamer. Remy told me about it and I've shown you guys before, I got really into the French vanilla and the caramel, but I finally got a hold of the cookie butter, which is the original one that Remy told me to try, and it is absolutely delicious. This is an almond and coconut creamer, but it's dairy free. It has like zero carbs, zero GMO, zero soy, keto friendly, dairy free, plant based, all the good things but tastes delicious and I'm obsessed and I've been having it in every coffee and I can't stop. Well, I have had probably the laziest morning of all time. It is it is damn near 11 a.m. I quite enjoyed it actually though. I edited and uploaded my Vlogmas Day 2. I watched some YouTube videos, caught up on a lot. I feel like I haven't actually sat and watched YouTube in a minute. And it was nice to like watch everyone's Vlogmas and see, you know, how everyone's Vlogmas are going. Um, it was inspiring and it was great and motivating. I completely did not go to my workout class this morning, which is not okay. Um, so. I am right now thinking that I need to force myself to do a little at-home workout, which is totally cool, it's totally fine. Do I feel like doing it? No, should I do it? Yes. So I'm gonna finish this coffee, I'm gonna suit up, get some movement going with my body, and then I think that'll get me you know, pumped up and ready to go for the rest of the day. Mm. Wish me luck. So I'm very excited. I didn't do Black Friday shopping like I have in the past this year. With COVID last year, wasn't able to do my normal Black Friday shopping. So this year I was very chill with my Black Friday shopping. I got my candles that I wanted. I got some stuff from Good American. And another thing I got is this jewelry that I'm very excited about. I'm gonna set you guys, set you guys down right here one second. Um, it's from Misoma. I've gotten jewelry from them in the past, um, but it's been, it's been a little minute and I'm very excited about this. Here's the package, and inside are the cutest little, cutest little gold hoops. They're so cute and chunky and adorable, and I'm very excited. I forget the percentage, but they were discounted, and I'm really excited to try them on. I'm gonna put them on right now. I'm uh, using the screen as a mirror. Hopefully I can do this blind. Oh my gosh, look how cute. They're the perfect size. I don't like big jewelry, I don't like big hoops, I don't like things that like get in the way of me living, and these are just the right, just the right size. There is a much better angle of them, you can see them a little better there, but it's cute because it's like big, little, little, tiny, kind of goes up, I like that a lot. Okay, lunch time, lunch time, let's go. Guys, look who's here, woo, hi. <laughs> we are going to lunch because we need sustenance, and we sustenance. are going to Target because sustenance. sustenance. <laughs> for the soul, for the soul, not for the wallet. The biggest complaint that I think me and Alicia and Taryn can all agree on about where we live is we don't live near a Target. Prior to living here, would go to Target regularly, um, and now I feel like when we go, it's a big ordeal because we're making a whole trip out of it, and I usually need like, 50 things instead of just going for yeah, one yeah. thing, which I loved going for one thing because I would just kind of like walk around, grab the one thing I need, maybe another thing that caught my eye and leave. And so now when I go, it's like, call everyone, like what do yeah. we need for the house? I'll get it now. So Target trips have become quite the ordeal like um, going to in our lives. Land. It is like going to Disneyland, especially during Christmas. Mm -hmm. And I haven't gone to Target since all the Christmas decor has come. so. They got some good stuff this year. So, 
That's what I'm gonna be doing. That's what we're both gonna be doing. Let's take a poll. Have we talked about this on this channel? We, I don't know if we've talked about it. I wanna know. We've talked about it on the podcast, I think. We talk and about I it every time we drive. We talk about it all the time. Yeah. I, I think people are gonna know. agree with me. I'm gonna say it. So Ashley likes to turn on air, but not the AC. So it's literally like someone's just sitting next to you going, that's what it feels because like. Because it's not hot, so I don't want cold. Because so you then just I'll like be the cold. air feeling on you. I don't like stagnant. I need some kind of movement in the air. I like so I'll turn the air on, but I don't want cold air because it's not hot. And I'll just be chilly. What would you prefer? <laughs> someone's hot Answer breath. The questions. Or no, air no, don't exaggerate. It's not someone's hot breath. It's air coming from the AC. It's just not cold. It's not a person breathing hot air. Is it? It's not a person. And it's not hot air. It's just air. All right, all right. vlogmas if I don't go to Target at least like four or five times so <laughs> the first one is starting today we're getting all the decor uh Taryn and I just ate so we're fueled we're fueled for the Target adventure um and also like I haven't gone to Target with Taryn in a hot minute I literally don't remember the last time yeah <laughs> so it's gonna be a good one all right here we go Guys, they have real wreaths here. This is, I was so unexpected. I'm getting it, obviously. It's not Christmas related, but yes please. Ah, oxygen. <laughs> Come on, Darren. No. We walked past the Lego aisle. Ugh, it's so hard for me. When Stefani's playing in the background, like if I was a rich girl, and that was one of my like original ringtones on my first I'm cell phone ever. Were you a rich girl? Yeah, <laughs> I wanted to be. This is such a pretty ornament. I'm excited for it. Put it on our tree. So Taryn, have yes. you heard that the talk of the town is you? Me? Mm-hmm. The talk of the town? Talk of the town. No. Is you. Why? Do you know what my number one requested video is for Vlogmas? Something with me, I'm guessing. Yes. It's a specific thing, no? Mm-hmm. Um... I'm trying to think, like, have we done it before? Yeah. Oh my gosh, I don't know. What do you mean you don't know? What have we done I'm just for? thinking of things we've done during Vlogmas. Vlogmas. Um, Gingerbread House? No. Um, please say going to Disneyland? Uh, no. What have we done during Vlogmas? What did we do last year, specifically? Last year? The like French French fry or drinks or fast food testing something. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Yes. That is my number one. Everyone keeps saying, "Are we gonna do it this year?" And then, so the whole reason we did it last year was because Morgan Adams posted that video. Yes. And I was like, "Yes, I want to do that with Taryn. It'll be so much fun." Guess what she posted already? She did it again. She did it again. So I feel like it's only appropriate that we. Yeah we copy her again. What did, did last time we tried shakes or We desserts? did holiday beverages. Holiday beverages. Which I feel like we should just do again. Yeah. But try to pick different places than we did yes. this last time because I'm assuming that a lot of the places are going to pick the same yeah. drinks. Yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, it was a lot of shakes. 
It was a lot of shakes. It was and a lot wasn't of milkshakes. It, like, it was like Wiener Schnitzel yeah. doing clutch. Which Wiener was Schnitzel like so was random. actually like fire, and we did not expect that. Mm-hmm. So pe- the people have spoken, and they want that again this year. I'm gang, thinking. Gang. I'm thinking. You know, maybe next week, or you know, yeah. whatever your schedule allows. Yeah. Pencil us in, and we then should, we can um, do it again. Start making a list. Yeah, I'll start working out now in preparation. What was nice though is we only really took like a sip or two of each, yeah. but then we finished. Because I knew, favorites. I knew, I was like, I can't. Yeah, six of these, I can't. Okay. I could. I mean, you could. We can do anything we put our minds to. Obviously. We are strong, independent women. Also, this feels like a very a uh, perfect segue to say that if you have not listened to mine and Terrence's podcast. If you love what you're seeing now, that's exactly what you get in the podcast. So a little bit of this, a little bit of that, and, you know, all the Mm -hmm. in-between. And it's a good time. So shameless self-promo. Go listen to our podcast. It's a great time. We give you advice. And if you have a story that you want to share and you want advice on, then we're your gals. So quick little Target haul. I already showed you guys the wreath. I already hung the wreath out front. You saw me and Taryn do the whole ceremony. It was beautiful. Um, So here is the decor that we have left. I got these little soap and lotion dispensers for my parents' house because my parents moved and I feel like they need that. Do they actually need it? Probably not, but I think they do. I got these three little trees. I think they're super cute. I'm going to throw them probably in the living room, maybe in the entryway. I haven't decided yet. A couple ornaments that'll look so good on the tree. I'm off these XO ornaments for, you know, my old handle on Instagram and put it on the tree. I feel like that'll be fun. I'll see if Felicia even notices this. Got some dish towels, got myself a new bath mat because I don't have one. Got a little like tree star topper. I think we're going to hang up three of these stockings with command hooks underneath the TV. But now that I'm looking at it, I don't think they're gonna fit. But we'll see, we'll see. Maybe we'll have to find somewhere else to do it. That feels like it would be flammable. We'll see. My whole life I've always had white bedding. I love white bedding. It feels like you're sleeping on a cloud and it makes me very happy. But I now have a little dachshund with black hair that just sheds everywhere. So I got a dark comforter set um, and sheet set. um, And I love it, but I also don't. It doesn't feel like a cloud and I love I love the white bedding. So I'm gonna throw this on top and see how I like it. That could be fun. Moving on to the rest of the haul. Also got some hangers because I'm running low and new wrapping paper for this year, which I'm super excited about. And that concludes the Target haul. It's a little later. Um, I'm going to hide the XO on the tree, but I want them to be like in plain sight and I want to see if Alicia notices. So I'm gonna do that now. I think I'm gonna put it on like the very front part. I don't want it too obvious, but like kind of obvious. Something like that. Same level. I feel like the same level's too obvious. Yeah. <laughs> it's so good. <laughs> oh, classic. The thing with Alicia is she's usually so tunnel visioned and focused on whatever her like main task is. It's usually work or or whatever. Um, I guarantee you she's not going to notice this for a while. I don't think she's going to notice it for a while. Unless she's like vlogging the tree, then she might notice it. But we should try to keep track of how many days that go by. Huh? How many days go by until she notices? (sighs) Too good.